CyberTracker is a type of software that can be installed onto PDAs or personal digital assistants. It's an efficient method for collecting data in the field, such as the location, area and density of a weed incursion. The end result is digital data that can be overlaid on a map and used for planning at a property, catchment or national scale. In this video, CyberTracker has been configured to collect weed data using a sequence installed by NT Government Weed Management Officers. Before you start collecting data, you can set some parameters about the survey to save time in the field and later in the office. First thing to do is to turn on the PDA. Sometimes you have to hold the button in for a little bit and then it will come on. Okay. To start the program, go from the start menu, look down the list and you'll find CyberTracker somewhere on the list. Use the arrows at the bottom of the screen to find the Start Survey page. Start screen should have numbers down the left hand side and that's the order that you do your setup in. Start from number one, work your way down. First thing we're going to do, set up your observers. Today I'm going to be a volunteer group. My name's Phil Hickey. You might be one of the observers. And today's job is going to be training. Next is the check screen. These have a yellow header and summarise the choices you've made so far. Go back if you want to make changes. Next step, setting up the weeds that you're going to work with today. To choose weeds from the list, first of all select the region you're in, we're in the top end. And we're working with common weeds, any of the weeds that are commonly found. For today's example, we're going to use just grasses, but you might use any type of weed in your survey. For today, I'm going to survey for gamba grass, for all types of mission grass and maybe olifime and acne as well. If you prefer you can select weeds by scientific name as well but for this example we'll be perfectly happy with a common name. Again you get a checklist to see what you've chosen. Here's my list of weeds selected for today. When you're ready to start, you start the track log for your survey. That's going to keep a track of everywhere where you walked around and looked. And set the time that the track log is recorded at. For walking on foot, I suggest 5 seconds is a good measure. The last thing to do before you head out into the field is go into the weed survey and say what it is that you're doing today. Today we're doing just a survey, we're not actually treating the weeds, so we'll select option one, survey only, no treatment. And notice I'm moving through the sequence by clicking in the bottom right hand corner. Everything is now set up, so we're ready to go forward into our survey. It's going to have one last check Again, yellow screen to check. No treatment, not today. And we're ready with the survey screen. You notice the GPS is activated, green mark on the map, and that's where we are. Here's some gamba grass. Record a weed. Weed is gamba grass. Check out the size. The size of the diameter is 20 metres in this case. The density, fair density will say it is density 4, 10 to 50 percent. And record a weed point. And off to the next.
size. Powder. Uh, finish the survey. Last thing to do. Back to the main screen. Finish with the end track and job's done.